Hi everybody, welcome to Coffee with Chao Wei. So today I'm in kind of like work from home clothes. It seems to be the trend today to show how you look like um, first thing in the morning. And I think a lot of what's in the news is kind of like fake news because like this is how people look like when they just wake up, right? And people also show like how they do like like yoga while like drinking coffee or something like that uh, but this is the best I can do all right so today we're gonna talk about a fairly common investment banking interview question what is your biggest regret or there are variations of it like I'll talk about a failure that you learned from or a challenge or something like that right so yesterday, um, Kim Lim, who is a, a billionaire's daughter in Singapore, wrote that her biggest regret in life is that she didn't do well in school when she was younger and disappointed her father. Right. So we're discussing this uh, question and and you know answer in the office, and I said, oh girl, that's like you know not not a super great answer. Right. Probably won't get you into investment banking. Uh, which you, you, you don't need to if you're a billionaire's daughter. Um, so, so they asked me like, how would I have answered it, right? So I thought back to what I had um, prepared as a canned answer when I was like 20, 22, right? So, uh, so I said that, oh, you know, I, mean, I prepared this, this um, answer uh, back then, uh, even though I didn't use it. So I said that, oh, um, I would have, uh, you know, I, I, I didn't do as well as I expected for my A-levels because I got a perfect score for my O-levels um, and then, you know, I learned that I shouldn't be so complacent. So as soon as I said that, I realized that that's a really lame answer, which is you really should not um, use, uh, that I'm falling into the trap of trying to change a mistake or a failure or a regret into like something positive like spinning it around right which is um you know when it when i was 20 or 22 it sounded perfectly okay or this is what i thought that the interviewer would want but now that i'm 42 and sitting in the interviewer's chair that's like that's really so fake you know and at best shows that you're like a super boring person with like no real life therefore you have no meaningful failures so then i said turn to uh yong jae who is our chief risk officer um and uh you know used to be an exotics uh, trader at jp morgan i'm like wait what would have been your answer since you said my answer so lame right so and he said that oh his uh, biggest regret was he didn't save someone when doing CPR because he has dated and I wasn't sure whether that was the sternum. Okay, I'm like, whoa, right? I've, I've known him for, um, so Yong is also my brother, right? So I haven't heard this story ever. And, um, you know, my first question to him was like, well, is that even like a real story? And he said, of course it's real. And I'm, I'm like, okay, so this is like something that is like meaningful, right? It's like, it's like a, well, well I, if I'm the interviewer, I would be like, whoa, okay, that's truly something that um, would have been a, a, a true regret. And I said, so is that how you got your job as, as a trader, right? And he said, no, actually, no one has ever asked him this question, right? So, I mean, or, or maybe, you know, I mean, he didn't, he didn't plan for this question. So I asked him, like, so what got you um, the job? And uh, and he said that oh they asked him what um, what is what motivates him what is what is his biggest motivation right and he said like oh you know and most people like you know give like lame answers like oh intellectual curiosity team spirit or something along those lines and I, at that time I felt a bit sheepish right because I probably would have said intellectual curiosity when I was like 20 21 22 right. And, and I said, so, so what do you answer? And he said, oh, money, right? So I thought like, that was like refreshingly uh, honest. And I think like, you know, if you want to go to investment banking, that, that truly is, is probably um, most people's biggest motivator. 
Okay, so that's it for um, Coffee with Chow today. And we'll see you next time. <laughs>